I think on that note, so we have a moosing competition coming up, don't we? So our next in-person national speed moot is coming up on the 7th of September yeah. at BPP in London Central. So it might be worth, John, just setting out the differences between our moots and a traditional moot. Yeah, absolutely. So um, the, the key difference with our moot is that we supply everything for you. So there are pre-drafted skeleton arguments included and all of the case law and legislation is included. So mm-hmm. that means there's no research and no drafting for you. Because we recognise how busy you are as a student or even if you're in work because our competitions are open to people who have graduated from any course. Basically, our competition is open to anyone as long as you are not practising as a barrister or solicitor. Yep. Um, So the opportunity is there for anyone. We know how busy you are. So there's no research and no drafting involved. Um, You get the problem the night before. So it's like being in practice when you get a late brief because... You get late briefs all the time in practice. The number of times that I get a brief an hour before the is <laughs> going in court is unbelievable. So it happens fairly regularly. Um, so, you, so you're getting the, the, the brief fairly late on. And we ask you to prepare for both sides because our competition involves 128 people. The winner will go through seven rounds in the course of that day. So from one, one round to the next, you won't know if you're for the appellant or the respondent. So that's why we say prepare for both, yep. because you've got to flip and flop between the two. Brilliant. And the other nice thing about our competition is that it's one-on-one. You enter as an individual, so you're not reliant upon a moving partner that might not put the same amount of effort in that you might, that might not have the same advocacy skills that you have. Yep. It's all down to your effort and, and your skills. Yep. So. And you're not relying on being chosen by your university to come along. Yeah. You can sign up completely well, well, independently it. yeah and as I, we could have 50 people we often do 50 people from one university if that's how many people choose yeah, to sign up it doesn't matter precisely there's no limit to the number of people from one uni that can sign up because that was that was a problem when i was at uni yeah you know, i wasn't in with the right click i would never be selected for mooting competitions so i had no opportunity to enter external competitions so we say no you're entering on your own you don't need to wait for your university your law society whatever it is to put you forward if you want to go have a go Get on our website and sign up. Yep. Yeah. And of course, a big difference that comes from, might be a hint from our name, is our submissions are severely shorter, yeah. speedier than Speed, a normal yeah. moot. I mean, I don't know. So ours are seven minutes long, aren't they? And then the final is 10. Yeah. How long is a traditional moot? About 20? So, I never did any moots. So school. it's two on two. So normally senior counsel speaks for 15, junior counsel about 10. Right. Um, so yeah, so you tend to find that each team does about 25 minutes worth of submissions. Yeah. Sometimes it can be longer, you know, it's mm-hmm. every competition has its own um, time limits. But from my experience of our internal competitions at uni, I think it was 15 for senior, yeah. 10 for junior. Well, there we go. That's a little bit of a difference between speed mooting and normal mooting competition. So, sign up is very, very healthy. It is. As these competitions always are. London is always super popular as well. So, get along to our website if you want to join us on the day. Yeah, a very good chunk of all the places have gone so far. People say, since when do you close sign up? We close sign up once all the places are gone. But there we go. You know, speedmooting.com and there's links all over the homepage for the Autumn Cup. So sign up and we look forward to seeing you there. And if you have any questions about the competition, info at speedmooting.com. Exactly.